Sounds great. Okay, so here is the big surprise that I have for Pit Monk because uh, I'm, I'm very familiar with his channel, and I know that there's one specific thing that he talks about a lot, and so that's going to tie in to the new science this week. So let me go ahead and get this screen share going, and we're going to talk about this new science. Let me know when you guys can see it. Visuals, okay. I wrote up a little piece here. Here we go. Poop could be a gold mine, literally. Surprisingly, treated solid waste contains gold, silver, and other metals, as well as rare elements such as palladium and vanadium that are used in electronics and alloys. Now, researchers are looking at identifying the metals that are getting flushed and how they can be recovered. This could decrease the need for mining and reduce the unwanted release of metals into the environment. If you can get rid of some of the nuisance metals that are currently limiting how much of these biosolids we can use on fields and in forests and at the same time recover valuable metals and other elements, that's a win-win, says Kathleen Smith, the person who spearheaded this research. How much of a win? How does millions of dollars of winning sound? In their recent environmental science and technology paper, the research group studying the issue calculated the waste from 1 million Americans could contain as much as $13 million worth of metals. That's money that could help fuel local economies. At $280 per ton of sludge, the money is just coming out of our asses. One of the problems facing the research is that they, is that they have no knowledge of all the other valuables that may be in our poop. Smith and her team are on a mission to find out exactly what is in our waste. We have a two-pronged approach, she says. In one part of the study, we're looking at removing some regulated metals from the biosolids that limit their use for land application. In the other part of the project, we're interested in collecting valuable metals that could be sold, including some of the more technologically important metals, such as vanadium and copper, that are in cell phones, computers, and alloys, Smith said. To do this, they're taking a page from the Industrial Mining Operations Method book and are experimenting with some of the same chemicals called lichates, which this industry uses to pull metals out of rock. While some of these lichates have a bad reputation for damaging ecosystems when they leak or spill into the environment, Smith says that in a control setting, a.k.a. coming out of your ass, they could be safely used to recover metals in treated solid waste. Boom! New science this week. Boom! Pit monk, does that make you want to go take a shit? It does, but, you know, it's calling it lichates. Why don't they just call it lichates? <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't know if I was mispronouncing it or not. I've never came across that word before. I've never heard of poop being expensive. That's pretty... Okay. <clears throat> hold on, hold on. Let me get this straight. My parents were actually lying, and they do crap money. <laughs> yes. Really? I In a sense. I think parents. Yeah. I mean, I... I'm just going to shit on all my enemies. <laughs> I've heard of people being so uptight that they could shit a diamond, but I never knew we had all this coming out of us. Uh, so he said, um, the waste from a million Americans could be worth $13 million. So basically, we were each shitting out $13 at some point. <laughs> That's not too shabby. You might want to start uh, collecting our own waste. <laughs> um, uh, Who the hell would want that, that job? That <laughs> I know, yeah, right? Um, where, where do I sign up? But but wait, but it's like shit, man. You don't know what's in that shit. Well, we can collect no. all the mercury from all the people with the vaccines, right? We'll collect all the mercury out. So. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. No, that's actually kind of worries me. It's like some of these are like really heavy metals, and that means they were in some people at some point. So I'm just kind of like, man, what's what's going? What are these people eating? <laughs> now hold on. I remember a Dave Chappelle skit where he's he talked about putting diamonds in your. Was he predicting the future? Is Dave Chappelle Nostradamus? <laughs> That's some good shit. No, it sounds like Dave Chappelle was actually right. <laughs> well, just imagine that Dave Chappelle being right and us mining poop 
for precious metals. 